Hello and welcome. This is Kristen from Life of Crafting and I am here with a new series called Let's Talk Paper and I will put down below the link. I am doing a Facebook page that's going to be showcasing cards made out of paper and anything basically having to do with paper. Buy, sell, whatever you want to do. So I will put that link down below. I'm trying to keep the video short and I'm only going to talk about one pack of paper but I want you to be able to see all of it. That's the point of these videos. So right now I am bringing out the Stamping Up Christmas video and I will say we are not just focused on Stamping Up on this channel. It will be a multitude, but I am in the process of creating an online registry of all of the Stamping Up papers going back to hopefully like 2012 to 14, depending on uh, what papers I have that I can get. I will be featuring back to there and I did not realize that there are so many and I have hundreds of paper to feature. So you will be seeing probably two or three of these videos in a week. So having said that, we are featured in the, we're featuring right now the mini Christmas catalog from September to December of 23 for Stamping Up. This particular pattern is from the Oh Holy Night Suite and it's on page 14 to 15 of the catalog. And this particular paper is called Oh Holy Night. It's featuring uh, basic black, boho blue, copper clay, crumb cake, misty moonlight, night of navy, pebble path, and very vanilla. I have noticed that a lot of stamping up papers right now are in this watercolored kind of effect of design, and I love it. Um, I guess it's one of them love-hate if you want to but it's very nice in the sense that these are creating these background scenes that you can basically just throw a, a sentiment on and go if you want. You can dress them up, you can just leave them the way they are. So this is the first one. This is the probably most iconic of the, the pack. It does have this kind of like a mosaic or it's kind of geographic print does have it modeled so that some of it is very crisp and some of it is kind of washed out. That is that paper. Then they have this one that almost looks like you're in a canyon. Very distressed in some sense. You know, you've got these like watermarks on the paper. So this is very brown as well. And the back has this fan type of design. And again, you have sections that are very dark in color and very light. You have the starry, snowy night sky. Very beautiful, if you ask me. And it backs up to more of that snowflake star and just very, nothing is uniform. So if you're a person that needs things very uniform, this is not going to be a collection for you. This is a very ombre looking one from the very dark black all the way through to the light. And this is just a black, oh, but you have to look real close. There is like this Venetian glass kind of print behind it, but you, oh, I don't know if I'm catching that on the camera. You really have to look for it. So that is that one. That would be a good one for like uh, mixing the match and some of these more busy patterns with. Very pretty of the skyline going to Bethlehem. And there is some very faint, almost looking like rectangles in there. I don't know if that's supposed to look like that in there. If it was how they applied the color, it, I don't know. The back is again, a very muddled changing of colors in there with that crisscross. Almost looks like barbed wire at times with these ones, but very pretty, very, very pretty. Another snowy night sky. Could be stars, could be snowflakes, however you wanna interpret that. And then almost looks like a screen or a mesh, but you do have these florets in the cross, the crossing of the lines. So this is the Oh Holy Night. It is a very beautiful pattern, but again, not going to be for the person who needs things very, um, like a print. This is, 
yeah, I don't know how else to express it. But anyway, if you're liking this series, appreciate some thumbs up. Subscribe down below because I have a lot, and I said hundreds coming. There is another paper that is part of this Holy, Holy Night. I will put that next in the lineup because they do mix and match in with this very beautifully, but I feel like they need their own video as well. So I'll catch you on the next one. Bye.